other stories now, where in another political shake-up in Peru, the interim president, Manuel Marino, has announced his resignation. Now, Marino, in fact, took over the presidency from Martin Vizcarra, who was ousted over allegations of bribery. Marino had been in office for less than a week after Peru's Congress had voted on the 9th of November to remove Martin Vizcarra as the president over bribery allegations, which he has denied. Neither Marino nor the head of the Congress have said anything about who would now be named as the president. In a televised speech, Marino had said that his resignation was irrevocable, and he also called for peace and unity. Queridos peruanos y peruanas, los lamentables hechos ocurridos en las últimas horas agravan la crisis que ya veníamos atravesando y que produjo hace unos días la vacancia presidencial del señor Martín Vizcarra. And after Vizcarra's impeachment, thousands in Peru had in fact staged some of the country's largest protests in decades. The protests were mostly peaceful, but were increasingly marred by clashes between the protesters and the police. And according to reports that have come in, two people have been killed so far in the clashes after the police cracked down on the protesters. Peruvians poured onto the streets to celebrate Marino's resignation. They waved flags, chanted and also banged pots. Now the announcement nonetheless has plunged Peru deeper into uncertainty and legal disarray as lawmakers are wrestling with who will now replace him. Peru is the world's second biggest copper producer that's also battling the coronavirus pandemic and what of course is expected to be its worst economic contraction in over a century. The Peru's impeached former President Martin Vizcarra hit out at his political opponents shortly after his successor, Manuel Marino, was forced to resign from the presidency. Accusing the opposition-led Congress of bringing a crisis upon Peru, Vizcarra said that it was now up to the country's constitutional court to determine the way forward. Ha salido un dictador suelo de palacio. No se trata de cambiar por otro que tenga mejor más estudios o que tenga mayor empatía o simpatía. No, de eso no se trata. Se, se, ¿Qué es lo que espera la población? ¿Qué cosa es lo que espera la comunidad internacional? La comunidad internacional. ¿Qué espera la comunidad? 